my boy. This is Packy's brother, General McCreary. Jerry, how's it going? Good. Got a little business opportunity I need your help with. Come and see me at my mom's house. Use the back entry. Jimmy, uh, let's go to my office. Okay, that's it, Jim, sir. Let's you're undercover. Up, oh, see Daisy. Uh, hey, Chief. Uh, hey, Mitch. Looking good. Gastric bypass worked out well for you, I see. Yeah, thanks. I'll tell my therapist about you. Tell him my boss keeps sexually harassing me. Oh, yeah, you wish. Oh, I could use a drink. You? No. Uh, oh, the motherfucker thinks he can drag me down. What's wrong now? Oh, man. Uh, sure. Listen, uh, where to begin? I don't know. Let me put it like this. If a guy makes a mistake, should that ruin his life? Now, people don't understand how life is. Life is like a, a bowl of fruit slowly rotting in a hot hey, kitchen. I don't give a fuck about the life lessons, friend. What do you want? I'm a good guy. I... He's got it all wrong. He's got but one stain on my character, and I'm finished. I want to make a difference. What? Uh, some lawyer. This big white shoe firm thinks he's a crusader. Some morality cunt who takes photos of guys in the shower at the gym and then jacks off on his wife's face. Hey, some... enough. Enough. Sorry. Look, the guy's name is Tom Goldberg. Thinks he's got something on me. Gonna go to the DA with it. Use it to get into Congress. Okay. Yeah. So, it's him or me. And it might as well be him, right? But, he's hard to get to. Guy's got a bodyguard, limo, everything. You're gonna need to get one-on-one -on -one with him. Not in the showers. Not in the showers, a job interview. Then, you can steal some files I need. An interview? Sure. It'll be easy. You're an immigrant. They're almost legally bound to interview you. But, uh, get yourself a suit. Okay. I will email you the details. You're a good man, Nico Bellic. A good man! Uh, coming from you, that means a lot. It does. We're going to the smell. I just laid some gas in here. Can I get you a smoke a lot a latte?
Hope the internet is worth it. Where you want to go, Heffy? I want to go to Joliet Street. Nobody knows this city better than me. I've sent off the application. I've always wanted to be a lawyer. You can be whatever you like. It's the land of opportunity. Any fool can become president. Call when you hear about the interview. This is it, my compadre. We're here. I can free that period up in my schedule. Super. Your interview will be with Mr. Goldberg. Press the buzzer and we'll let you in. Have a nice day. I have an interview with Goldberg tomorrow. Perfect. The smug bastard ain't gonna know what's coming at him. Teach him for sticking his nose in other people's business and get the files.
Uh, it's Nico Bellic. I'm here for an interview. Come in, I'll buzz you through. Welcome to Goldberg, Ligner, and Scheister, sir. Mr. Bellic, welcome. I'll just see if Mr. Goldberg is available. Mr. Goldberg. Mr. Bellick has arrived for his interview. Okay, great. Uh, tell him to come through to my office. Would you please follow me, Mr. Bellick? Sure. Mr. Goldberg is such a saint. He teaches kids to swim, you know. He's just so warm and giving. All he cares about is making the world a better place. And boy, are you in trouble if you get in his way. Do you think he'll like me? He's just in here. Don't be nervous. He doesn't bite. Hello, Nico. What's that short for, Nikolai? I'm looking for a man who can get jobs done right. Nikolai, I like your resume. You seem to be the sort of man who would go the extra distance. I just need to take another look. Get myself reacquainted with your experience. So, you're the sort of man who doesn't wait to get told what to do. A guy who looks at the world, sees problems, and tries to fix them? Sure. My problem is that people don't notice the decay in society. They leave the decay alone, and soon it's too late, so you have to pull the whole tooth. Yeah? I am the guy who goes around shaking people. For people, read society, read City Hall. I shake them, and I say floss. Get rid of the rotting flesh stuck in your teeth. Prevent decay. Mouthwash, you hear me? There's this cop. Good cop, but he thinks he's above the law. He's not. You want to know why? Because the law is clear. I'm going to crush him into dust. No one is above my judgment. You understand me? Okay. Here at GLNS, we're pushing things to the limit. We're on the front line, young man. A man I was recently with in this office, in this very room, was murdered. You got to fight for what is just in this world. You do. Anyway, give me an example of some time where you've worked as part of a team. I work alone. So, are you going to expand on that, or are you just going to hang around like a chump? Sure, stand up if you want to. Whatever makes you comfortable. You're just a waste of space, aren't you? Oh, whoa, 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 hold on. Where are the files for your case against McCreary? Shit, they're on my desk. I never hurt anyone. I wouldn't be here if you'd never hurt anyone.
Doesn't that smell good? Here are the files. Great. Peace at last. I feel cleansed. You silenced Goldberg, too, right? I don't need to worry about him? He's done. Whoa, music to my ears. A weight has been lifted. Here's your payment. <laughs>